Today, we'll be discussing the process of how to link Tenable IO or Tenable SC into your JIRA on-prem version 7. Version 7 is currently the only supported version for this integration. You'll first go to our downloads page, which is tenable.com forward slash downloads. Then go to integrations and download the JIRA on-prem plugin for Tenable. That should download as a OBR file. Once the file is downloaded, you'll go to your JIRA as the administrator and go to settings and add-ons. Then you'll be taken to manage apps and you'll upload the OBR file. You can then proceed to upload the file and the add-on will now be installed on your JIRA on-prem. Once installed, you'll be able to see that the add-on plugin is now included. Then you can go into the modules and see what has been added. If you are strictly using Tenable IO, you can disable the Tenable SE portion. If you're using Tenable SE, you can disable the Tenable IO portion. Refresh the page and you'll now see Tenable IO configuration and Tenable SE configuration that is available. Go to Tenable IO and here is the address for Tenable IO, which is cloud.tenable.com. You'll in enter your access key found in settings, my account, API keys, and generate your key. You'll see your access and secret key. That is where you'll enter the access and secret key for the Tenable IO configuration. You can also specify the vulnerabilities and the sync time. In this case, I'm gonna set for June 1st, and you can determine what the lowest severity will be imported, either that be low or informational. You can set the interval, default being 60. I will then select the project. You can create a project for the Tenable IO vulnerabilities, so that there is a separate section in your JIRA for the Tenable IO vulnerabilities. I will then save, and that will now link Tenable IO vulnerabilities into your JIRA on-prem. For Tenable SE, very similar process. You'll enter the Tenable SE IP address, the username, and the password. The sync of the vulnerability since the lowest severity, the interval, and then similarly, you can create a project for your Tenable SE vulnerabilities, and you can save. Now I'm gonna drop down, and I can see my projects, and you'll now see the vulnerabilities from Tenable IO or Tenable SE. Available in each of your projects as a ticket or issue. That is the process of adding Tenable Jira on-prem plugin version two to Jira version seven.